Oh, how insanely we joked about Alaster last time. He got so scared. I think after that, he'll develop Parkinson's disease. He thought that I was you. Because of the surprise, he grabbed me between the legs and in his hand was my unwashed dick. You... Don't tell me about this nastiness. I'm about to vomit bile. Oh, come on. Just a little time will pass. And I promise you my dick will be in his mouth non-stop releasing sperm. I beg you, Angel Dust. Don't talk to me about your fetishes. Damn, they are such hypocrites. I hope they die of tuberculosis for such words about me. And Angel Dust, I'll personally tear off his gay swollen balls. Castration is the only way to get rid of his intense attraction to my groin area. Uh, for example, after castration, my cat started watching anime and cleaning up its own poop in the litter box by eating it. I think the same will happen to Angel Dust. All right, jokes aside, but I really have to figure out what to do with them. I need to come up with some punishment for their correction. Something they'll remember for the rest of their lives. Maybe it'll be a Thai massage with thorny gloves or BDSM stretching. Excellent! How could I forget about this potion? If I use this potion, they will instantly lose consciousness, and I can do whatever I want. For example, smearing Angel Dust's anal opening with chili pepper with a heat of 5,000,000 Scoville units. Ah, ah, ah! Well, I found where this lover of blue and rainbows is hiding, and his girlfriend who smells terribly fishy between her legs. I was able to track their location by the vomiting mosquitoes falling from the sky because their lewd conversations make even these insects end their lives alternatively. You know what, Angel Dust? I think that if Alaster finds out that you're planning to joke about him again, he'll tear off your tool for creating golden showers. Let Alistar take my hairy balls into his mouth. I'll only get bonuses from that, namely clean balls. Oh, I think Alistar will be very angry with you. Screw him, that Alastar. I'm still cooler than him, at least because I have four hands and I can jerk off four dicks at once. Wouldn't be surprised if you have more holes, too. Oh, screw you? I wish you'd catch a bouquet of venereal diseases somewhere. No one ever gives you bouquets of flowers anyway, and this one will stay with you for life. Hey you! Listen here, my perverted friends! Damn it, Alastor! What's happening? You think I don't know about your plans? You think you can deceive me into taking your dick again? Not gonna happen, you rear-drive idiot! Time for you to experience the real divine anal lubricant squeezed from a bull's appendix! Ah, oh, my, my god, god, my head, my is, head spinning. is spinning! What the heck did you just did you throw just at me? me? Yeah, my, yeah, my head, head is spinning, spinning so much, so much too. too! Damn, Damn I, feel I feel so, so sick. sick! Oh, how well I slept in my coffin and now I can proceed to punishing my new slaves! Hope they don't even suspect how perverted I can think compared to them! Hey girls, and almost a girl! How are you doing? Hey, let me out, you damn dictator! I will never ask you for a blowjob again, I promise! I won't even think about it! I already said, I won't let you out just like that! Alaster, come on, please let us out! We're still your friends! You shouldn't be so cruel to us! Friends who discussed how my mouth will be filled with sperm? No longer friends! In short, friends, you are in for some truly terrible trials today! This will be your punishment! I've prepared real tortures for you that will make your nails start to peel and your pubic hair fall out. Oh no, not that. Oh yes. I hope there will be anal beads and an anal plug to boot. Oh my god, you can't be scared by anything. Damn pervert, I wonder if there's anything you're afraid of. I'm really scared of becoming heterosexual, baby. And I'm also scared that testosterone will come back to me and my chest will stop growing. So all of you get out of here. Oh my god, thank you for letting us out. We're leaving, just please don't hit. So, listen to me carefully. Now will be the first trial. Charlie, right now, stand on this bonfire to feel the hellish pain from the hot cold. Damn, it hurts so much. I can't stand here. Ha, 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 ha. That's your punishment for switching to the rainbow side. Okay, now you, my bluish friend, stand on this bonfire with your feet, pictures of which you sell on adult websites. You won't believe how pleasant this is for me. This is the best orgasm of my life. Wish there was more gas. Ah, uh, you damn pervert. Uh, but nothing. The next punishment you definitely won't like. It will not be an orgasm, but sarcasm. He's just gone mad. This is madness. Oh, stop. He's just having fun. I really like his role-playing games. I think he's even flirting with us because I saw a bulge in his pants. I hope in a burst of excitement he'll want to stick this hot wood up my ass. Damn, you're just disgusting. Oh, come on. You'd want to stick it in your mouth yourself. You're just shy to say it in public. So shut up, both of you, as if we got geniuses from an orphanage here. Anyway, the next punishment, hear that you rear-driven amoeba. Come over here. What do I need to do? Bend over, bitch. 
Now you will know all the cruelty of your thinking and desires. You will cry and beg for mercy. Stop! What? Oh yes, please spank me and drag your dick across my thighs and then stick it in my ass and fuck me, please. What the fuck? What the hell is happening? You're supposed to be crying, not enjoying! Listen, Alaster, I think this is totally not working against him. So are you going to spank me or not? Or maybe I should start preparing my cloaca? God, you guys are so hard to deal with! I can't even punish you because you enjoy my tortures! All right, listen up! Get out of there, or else I will force you to leave the trap! Damn it! I thought the real fun was starting! You know what, Charlie? It seems I've come up with something. A sneaky plan popped into my head on how to make Angel Dust suffer even more than you. He will cry from pain and beg for mercy, but I will refuse. It's going to be very amusing. Dear Lord, do you really think that anything can scare me? I'm fearless. I'm not afraid of anything. Not even spiders and hungry hyenas. Ah! Uh -uh. Oh my gosh! Are those real girls? Oh my god! How scary for me! Girls, what do you want from me? Just don't come closer because I'm into boys! Please don't come near me! I won't get hard for you! But don't scream, my sweet! Let's sleep together! Oh no, no, no! Please don't touch me! I'm disgusted by girls I only love boys! Don't ruin my homosexuality! Looks like we really got him good! Yes, I think it was the best prank in history! I didn't think he would get so scared! It was very cool. And are you planning to transform back? Or will you keep standing there as a sex doll from AliExpress? Yeah, everything just got a bit dragged out. Well, the most important thing is that I taught him a lesson. Did you see how fast he flew down to the bottom? Wait, Charlie, please remind me, what floor is this? If I'm not mistaken, it's the 21st- Damn, we need to get down fast. He probably fell and turned into a pancake. We need to quickly collect his meat in a bag and freeze it before it spoils. What were you thinking when you got to the second floor? And indeed, the highest floor in our hotel. Let's hurry down to help Angel Dust. Hurry up, get down. Oh God, you sat right on my face, it smells. It feels like I've smeared myself with herring or sur strumming. Stop talking, let's run outside. But we need to run to the right. Where did Charlie run off to? Apparently you're blind or you had a bad grade in school for orienteering. But I know a shorter way out to the street, idiot! All right, you're right. We're approaching the exit. Oh my god, my eyes! So bright! Wait, stop what? Guys, can you believe I survived? Falling from a great height, I remembered how in shooters like CSGO or Minecraft they put a water bucket under themselves, but I put under me a huge rubber... Ah, uh, enough! Shut up! I get what you put under yourself! God, what a horror, but I'm glad you're okay and your anus isn't bleeding. Yeah, thanks. Alaster, don't you want to jump on it too? <sighs> How you annoy me, I hate you. Take the 10,000 slap of my enchanted hand. I'll delete you much faster than I jerk off. Leave me alone, please, because I start to get excited from the testosterone floating in the air. Just stop breathing through your nose, idiot. Hey, stop, typical Mercedes fan. I won't stop. I won't give in to your requests. Leave me alone, you two idiots. So, Charlie, stop. There's no need to run after him. What do you mean, what? We won't catch him like this. I have a very cunning plan. What, what plan do you have? We need to catch him like a boar in a forest trap. Follow me. I've built a trap for him. I have the perfect plan for building a trap specifically for homosexuals. I don't understand what you're setting up. I'm building something that will finally punish Angel Dust in such a way that he'll remember it for the rest of his life and also tell this story to his grandkids from a surrogate mother. My God, can you say what you're building? I beg you, don't panic. I think seeing this anvil, you immediately understood everything, Charlie. I still don't understand anything. I only have an IQ of three. What is this? You'll see for yourself. Let's call this lover of anal pleasures and BMW over here. Hey, idiot, come here. Oh, come on, Alaster. How about I just work with my hands and mouth and you'll calm down as soon as you finish on my eye? My final verdict. You have to accept the punishment or it will only get worse for you. Yeah, just take the punishment or he won't leave you alone. Oh, fine, if I must. But promise me that you'll stop sending negative energy into my positive aura. I really don't care about your opinion. Just come here and do everything I tell you. Stand right here on this torch. You love elongated objects, especially hot ones. Wow, I like this punishment. You want me to sit on this erect torch? Oh, yes, I really want to see how you sit down on this hot torch. I think your anus will really enjoy feeling the burning soot and the roasted pieces of unwiped poop. Let's go! Oh no, I didn't even expect this. My God, what have I done? Are you guys completely nuts? What have you done to me? I now look like a pancake or a buffalo. Now I can fuck two hot guys simultaneously with each side of my head. Ouch, that hurts. Stop, Angel Dust. 
Aren't you happy with the outcome? And what's the plus side to this? But now you can easily suck off a huge dick like from an elephant or a giraffe. Uh, damn, that's not funny. My face looks like a printer. Ha ha ha. And if you spin around really fast now, you could take off like a helicopter. Come here. I want to whisper something in your ear so Charlie can't hear. Come closer. Ouch, damn, that hurts. You've left a bruise on half my head. So what are we going to do with you now? I don't know. I've never seen anything like this. Just look at him. He looks like he's been stretched in Photoshop. God, why are we even in such a game to discuss this? Well, actually, yes, we are in a game, if you didn't know. Wait, what? So we're characters? Yes, we're characters. I thought you knew about this. Well then, let's get out of this game and conquer the whole world. We just need to find out which side the screen is on. Yes, we need to find where the screen is. You guys are annoying with your thinking. You're just characters who do everything according to the script. Don't forget, you need to stick to the plot. Let's better decide what you're going to do with me and how you'll cure me. Run after me. I think I have an idea on how to fix your huge sucker. I don't believe that without surgical intervention, you can fix this situation without damaging my eardrums. So shut up and step into this circle immediately. Ah, uh, no, I don't want to. I've had enough in the last episode. My rear end still hurts. I don't care whether you want to or not. Uh, and what's going to happen now? This is definitely something you can't show on YouTube.